Hey, how's everybody doing this afternoon? It's uh, 2.35. Uh, I've got rain real close. It's probably, uh, the rain is probably 45 minutes away. Pretty good band of it too. I've been tracking it since Jackson, Tennessee. And uh, anyway, I worked until noon today and uh, got home about 12.30, got right on the right on the tractor and the disc, dressed everything up real nice, got everything smoothed back up. First thing we're gonna plant is uh, these food plot, uh, food plot soybeans. I understand it's late in the season. I just want them to come up. So, uh, you know, due to the drought, uh, everything was put off. So I'm gonna put this stuff in the ground. Depending on the time and, and the rain, they're calling for steady rain. Uh, may just let the rain pack it in instead of covering it up. So got here, got the got everything mixed up, soybeans, uh, food plot soybeans. Little uh what is this? Uh, it's triple twelve fertilized, just something to get it. Uh, you know, fertilizer helps it spread better. That's the way we did it. So that's the way I'm gonna do it. And uh, we'll go put this out. Hope everybody's ready for the weekend. I know I am. Of course, my work week starts starts on a Sunday. So uh, I'll only have tomorrow off. Tomorrow's a uh, full day off. But but it was a short week for me because of the Louisiana trip. Stop for a minute. Y'all can see right here. It all dressed up great. BTO. Spreader open. right here is cow peas being on a from a dairy farm we used to plant cow peas I'm sure this is not the same type of cow pea but uh, I planted a bunch of cow peas they didn't quite they didn't quite look like this but a long time ago Anyhow, y'all know what I'm doing, so I'm gonna go spread this. This big food plot number two. We'll go spread this out, and uh, uh, we'll be back. I'll be back here in a few minutes. All right, spread the cow peas.
meet y'all back at the barn. All right, food plot number three. Got purple top turnips, seven top. The purple top, of course, is the one that makes the turnip. Seven top does not. So, <coughs> excuse me. So anyway, that's for food plot. Number three. Y'all got the idea, so you know I'm gonna be back in a few minutes for the last batch. Alright, food plot number four. Got a little variety of everything. Soybeans, ryegrass, turnip greens, and uh, of course fertilize. So, yeah, ryegrass, soybeans, turnip rings. The only thing I didn't plant, I had five pounds, well, that ain't nothing to y'all, but five pounds of alfalfa. Now, with that drought we had, I missed the time window that they said was recommended for our region here, which was August the 15th, which I, th I still think that's a little too hot at that time, to September the 15th, which is, my opinion, a little bit more reasonable, but with no rain, I couldn't do that. So, if, you all think this will work. I know Ag Wild, I know you've done alfalfa. I've seen your video, at least I'm pretty sure you uh doing hay. If you think I can plant this here, plant this here, let me know. I'm not sure. He, he's the only one that I can think of offhand, but if anybody else thinks I can plant that here and it still come up, just leave me a leave me a comment so I'm gonna go put this out all right put this out real quick Praise the Lord. Got everything done. Just looking over. This is the most rocky area right here, but this was the soybeans. Food plot number one. Real good even coverage. Number two. Cow peas. And number three was the turnip greens. You won't be able to really see them. But
guess what? Starting to rain. Worked out beautifully. So, I couldn't be more happy right now. As far as, I'd like to get them covered up, we'll see. Got fertilizer stuff all over the tractor. get all these videos spliced in and like I said YouTube's got me at a 15 minute limit so don't worry I won't be going over 15 minutes anybody like what I do here on this little small small piece of property I'll never say I have a farm here because I don't I come from a farm but it's just a small piece of property that I like to I like to play with so Y'all like what I'm doing? Share that with someone if you don't mind. All right. Just got everything covered up. Oh yeah, what y'all think about my homemade drag I made several years ago, but old piece of chain link fence. A couple of old two by fours sistered them together I guess sandwich them together a couple old chains off my kids swing set does good it does it does okay no, just leave it at that it does all right you know when my daddy when my daddy bought that tractor brand new he also bought a set of John Deere three-point hitch spike tooth hairs it was uh, two sections and uh it was a, a you know factory style three-point hitch bought that the tractor all on the same day but anyway uh when he passed uh, uh them hairs kind of slipped through our fingers so uh i tried to recover them over the weekend back in louisiana it was kind of unsuccessful but anyway uh, got everything covered up. It slicked it on down pretty good. Anyway, that does it for the food plots. I will be doing updates, uh, video updates on the food plots. 